Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. And if you're new here, my name is Audrey. And today I have for y'all another Shein haul, <laughs> of course. So if you haven't already hit that subscribe button and that notification bell to let you know when I upload a new video. And this isn't gonna be a big haul, but it is a cute haul. So let's go ahead and get started. Before I actually show y'all this outfit first, I just want to say thank you to all of y'all for being here. I Y'all have no idea how much it means to me. And so I've mentioned on here that my boyfriend has his own YouTube channel. He started a couple years before I started this one. And so with his channel and his hobbies, we go to a lot of comic cons, toy shows, different things like that. And I'm not going to name a name, but because I don't want to embarrass you if you don't want me to, but we were at a Comic-Con yesterday. We went to Augusta, Georgia, and just for the day, I was off work, and we just wanted to get away and go to this toy. It was a G.I. Joe, Joe Fest. Well, anyway, <laughs> anyway, we had not been there very long, and someone walked up to me and said, are you Audrey? And it was one of you. It was one of my viewers and y'all it meant the world to me to meet her and she was so sweet and uh, you just have no idea what that meant to me and I was it so a huge thank you to you and you know who you are for coming up to me and speaking to me it made my entire day you have no idea because I was there for him it was his thing people knew him from his channel and I never in a million years ever thought that I would ever meet one of y'all and uh, it just means everything to me and I just I just wanted to say a huge thank you for reaching out to me and introducing yourself because that was such a beautiful moment for me and it just I think it probably means more to me than y'all will ever know <laughs> And so I just wanted to say a huge thank you to you for talking to me. It just meant a lot to me and it just did my heart good. That's all I wanted to say about that. It just, thank you. So thank you to you and thank you to all of y'all because this is just so important to me and it means everything to me. So the first time we're going to go ahead and get started with this haul. So the first look in this haul, I have this little blue and white pinstripe top. It's a, I guess not really a peplum, it's just got that elastic waist here. I did go with the 3XL, even though it is the faux wrap, I usually size down in that, but with the measurements, wasn't really sure where to go. So I went with the 3XL and I really like it. The elastic isn't as forgiving as most, but I do love it. And this one is 100% polyester. And y'all, the sleeves on this. Let me just show you the sleeves. Look at the ruffle. You have me with ruffles. I absolutely love anything with ruffles, you know. But these are adorable. They go all the way around. More of a dolman sleeve. Your faux wrap here. You've got the same little ruffle across the waist here. And I have got to make sure there's not a cat behind me. They like to run behind me. <laughs> And I paired it with some white jeans that I got. I believe that these are Levi's, I think. They're very see-through and that just, ugh. So, yeah, you can see through them. So you can see all your little lumps and bumps. If y'all know of any really good white denim that I can get, because I love white denim in the summer. I don't wear it after Labor Day and before and all that. It's just an old rule, but... <laughs> But I need some good white denim that you can't see straight through. And I mean, these are nice, they fit well, but you can see every little dimple and roll in these things. And I also have on my little shoes that I showed y'all in my last haul. They're Cuckoo. Again, no confirmation on how to say that yet, but that's what these are. They're the little mesh wedges. And I did mention that they are not the most comfortable and these are not. All the other ones are. These particular ones, not that comfortable, <laughs> to be honest, but they're easy to put on and off, so I just paired them with this look. I thought it was really cute, easy for summer, feels good, easy breezy, and I love it. So, here is the front and the back. Hmm. 
Now the next top in this haul, I love this top. I love the cut of this. So I went with a 3XL and it is 100% polyester. And I gotta tell you, got a lot of static in this one. <laughs> I ironed it and I put a little bit of starch spray on it hoping that it would take it out. But it is sticking a little bit, but that's okay. So this one is another dolman. I'm not sure what the difference in a bat wing and a dolman is. I try to keep up with this stuff, but it gets a little confusing because sometimes they look alike. But whatever this one is, I love the shape of this shirt. <laughs> I just think it's so pretty because I usually don't like my entire arm to be exposed. So this is still the comfort of a sleeveless type top but you still got a little bit of coverage and it's just open down here i just love this i love the shape of this you've got a higher neckline that's pretty sleeves so there's no belt loops in this you do have a sash belt it's just a removable belt this is what it looks like without the belt so it is seamed across here so it gives a little bit of that peplum shape but you don't really get that until you tie the sash belt. So sometimes belt loops can be a problem because occasionally they will be put a little too high or a little too low. At least with this, you can put it wherever you want. And if you're like me and I have, <laughs> I have some pretty, if you can see my hips, like they're kind of chunky. So I have enough to hold the belt up. <laughs> Let's put it that way. It's not gonna go sliding down. It has nowhere to go but up. So, <laughs> so at least it stays where it's supposed to be. And I just paired it with that black skirt from Eloquii that y'all have seen quite a few times and another pair of cuckoo shoes. <laughs> I just love the name, I think it's so cute. So these are the really pointy black flats that I showed y'all in my last haul. Very comfortable. I'm still not quite used to how pointy they are. I've just never worn any like this but i love it especially with this whole look i just think it's so pretty and feminine a little bit a little bit vintage kind of but i just love it i think this is just so pretty i know that there's a difference in the black tones but that's okay so here is the front and back And now the next shirt in this haul, y'all. <laughs> Occasionally, Shein will come out with something that I just, I cannot be without. I just have to have it. This is one of those things. I'm gonna try to show you the pattern, the print on this up close. It's little pinup mermaids. <laughs> They're so cute. And it has summer love written, kind of faded right across. It's all over. You've got little stars and little circles and you've got these little pinup mermaids with seashells. It is so stinking cute. I love this. So I went with the 4XL in this one. I could not have sized down because I didn't want it to be, because I didn't want it to be pulling up here the perfect fit. So again, y'all, my measurements are always in the description below if you need them to help reference. So I went with a 4XL in this one and I am in love. 100% polyester, not real clingy, it's not hot. This is a really soft fabric and it feels so good on your skin. I am in love with this. It is a button up, just your traditional, it's just your traditional collared button up short sleeve top. And like always, I will untie it and show you the full length of it afterwards, but I did tie it here. Now I did keep on the same pencil skirt and little flats as before, but I just wanted y'all to see this because it is the cutest, cutest blouse ever. I am in love with this thing. It is adorable. It's just the cutest thing ever. So here is the front and the back. And here is that same shirt untied. So it is a very generous fit. It's not too tight across here. You know, sometimes I have mentioned with button ups, they'll be a little bit, it's like they get smaller the further down they go. <laughs> but this one does not do that. It is the perfect length. 
If you want to wear it undone, you can wear it unbuttoned with something underneath, however you want to do it. But it is a full length blouse and it is adorable. And now on to the dresses. So I'm gonna go ahead and tell y'all, I have two more dresses after this one, but this one is absolutely my favorite. <laughs> I am in love with this dress. I, let me just show you, I'll just step back. This is the cutest dress ever. I love this dress. Y'all know I love the color. I think it is just beautiful. And I'm gonna show you the fabric. So I went with a 4XL in this one, and y'all, I could not have sized down. There was no wiggle room in this one at all. It is 100% polyester, but it feels very cottony. It is really, really comfortable. And I'll show you, you can see it has little stripes and little dots like in the fabric. So it is raised, you can see them kind of sticking up. So it was a little bit of a pain ironing this, but once I got it ironed, I am, I am in love. This is adorable you have elastic up here so you have plenty of room so if you are a little bit more on the bustier side but you're smaller here i think this would be the perfect dress for you because you can just make sure you buy the one that fits your waist measurement and then up here you've got plenty of room there is so much room in this just to show you there's plenty of room it does have a decorative tie here it does not make it any tighter and i love that the fabric comes a little bit closer together because some I've shown some dresses on here before a few times that this this part will be stretchy and then this part comes way out here it just seems a little bit exposed so I think it's something very there's just something very pretty and different about this dress because of where the fabric hits right here in my opinion and so your sleeves are that really cute puff sleeve and you do have elastic in the armband but i'm gonna tell you the armband is a little bit tight as you can see it's lifting on this arm you know i had that a lot on that side but it is kind of lifting a little bit on this arm so there's not a whole lot of wiggle room in the sleeves on this one so again 4xl perfect fit in the waist perfect everywhere just the tiniest bit tight in the sleeves right here but they are elastic so you can move them around if you get a little bit uncomfortable and you also have a little ruffle across the bottom of this dress invisible zipper up the back but i did not need it i just pulled it right over my head and i paired this with those little mesh wedges that i showed y'all a little bit ago and all of these shoes and everything will be linked below too so here is the front and back And now the next dress, I really do like this one. The one I just showed y'all is definitely my favorite, but this one is a pretty close second. So I went with the 3XL in this one, and it is polyester elastane mix. So this one has a lot of little things going on. <laughs> so there's no zipper in this one. You just pull it right over your head. The whole top is elastic. So as you can see, you've got an elastic band here Again, plenty of room in the bust on this one. I never have the right bra for this, so I just pulled my straps down. <laughs> but I don't, I think you can wear it off shoulder if you want to, or you can pull it up, but mine just keeps kind of falling down, so we're just gonna let it do whatever it wants to. The sleeves have elastic in them. Again, not the most loose fit elastic in the arms, but I do have bigger arms. I do carry weight in my upper arms, but not uncomfortable, nothing, Nothing bad, nothing pulling. The waist of this one is pretty interesting. So you have three little elastic pieces. You can see them going across the waist right here just to bring that in, but it does kind of poof out a little bit. So if you don't like that, just be mindful of that. It does kind of, so my little part right here, <laughs> it just kind of pushes through right here. So it looks like a ruffle, but it's me. So. I really do love this one, and you do have that tiered skirt. You have two tiers in the bottom, and it is the perfect color of blue. More of a cornflower blue. I'm not sure how it's gonna pick up on camera, but it is a very pretty cornflower blue. And I wanted to show you the texture of this. Again, this was not the easiest one to iron, so if you have a steamer, I do have one, but it's just a lot of work 
for me to deal with. <laughs> and I'm going to be using it tomorrow. I have a formal wear haul that I'm going to be filming tomorrow. So I did not want to deal with the steamer two days in a row. So I just went with a traditional iron. So I finally got all the wrinkles out of this one. and But I just wanted to show you the texture of this. So you can see more stripes here, but it has a puckering. It's made to be like a puckered, I guess puckered fabric. But you can see there is a lot of texture in this. Very pretty. I, again, I love this color blue. I think it is beautiful. It does hug a little bit right here, but that is to be expected. But as you can see, when I move a certain way, you can see that belly line right here. So you can always put on some nude shapewear with this, just if that bothers you to kind of hide that. So I was curious how this would look with one of my belts that y'all have seen so many times. But I just wanted to see how that would look with this, just to kind of break up the waist a little bit. Because this is a lot of blue going on in this dress. <laughs> so I'm going to put on my belt and I'm going to see how that looks. So we'll find out together. And here is that dress belted. As always, this belt will be linked down below. It is from Amazon and it is my favorite kind of belt ever. It's a cinch belt and it just buckles right in the front. So it's really easy to put on and take off. So here it is belted. I like it both ways to be honest, but y'all just let me know. But I do like it both ways. I think it's a beautiful dress, very comfortable and easy to put on and easy to be in. So here is the front and the back. And now for the last piece in this haul, I have this dress. It is a beauty. I went with the 3XL and it is a polyester spandex mix. So this is a true shirt dress. So it buttons all the way down the front. You have a little bit of an empire waist right here. I'm gonna show you it comes under the bust into a triangle and then it's that banded waist. Plenty of room in this. Again, I went with the 3XL. There is no elastic in the waist but I don't feel like it's pulling. I mean, it fits, but it's not pulling those buttons apart. It just feels really comfortable. So I'm gonna show you the fabric because it's beautiful. It's different because you don't see a lot of this. I'll show you. You don't see a whole lot of ivory. You usually they're white flowers. I don't know. There's something about this color combination that I think is so pretty. It's simple. It's just almost like hand-drawn flowers. The flowers are outlined in black, and then this really pretty blue, and then this tan ivory flower. I just think that's beautiful. And you have those little faux wood buttons down here. Now, I'm going to tell you, it's cut very low. So I do have a little safety pin right here, but I'll take it out so you can see how low it comes. Some people don't mind, I, but it does, it's cut it's cut down to here. So again, it's not drastically low, but it was showing my bra and I didn't really want to do that. So I did put a little safety pin in here and nobody can even tell, but I just didn't want it to be that low. So my favorite part of this dress are the ties on the sleeves. I talk about this a lot and Shein has quite a few pieces that have these because I've mentioned my arms are a little bit bigger and I like to be able to control how tight sleeves are. Just like earlier, it had elastic in it, but it was just the tiniest bit uncomfortable because there just wasn't enough room. With these, you just untie them and you tie them however tight or however loose you want them to where you're comfortable. I, I love these ties on these sleeves and just the overall look of this, I think it's beautiful. The dress is flowy. You do have that little split in the front. And I did not mention in the other ones, I'm 5'6", so this one is definitely a true midi. It hits right at the bottom of my calf. I'm in love with this, and I did pair it with those little cross strap espadrilles that are also by Cuckoo, so they will be linked below too. These, I think, were y'all's favorite. I had the most questions about these shoes. They are so comfortable, easy to take off, put on, slip your foot in and fix the little straps. Perfect. So, here is the front and the back.
And that is all I have for y'all in this haul today. And a huge thank you to every single one of y'all for being here. Because as we speak, I think I'm like three subscribers away from 10,000. <laughs> I'm somewhere close to that. So I'm like right at 10,000 subscribers. And I never thought that I would see that. So this channel has grown really fast in the one year that I've been here. And I am so thankful for each and every single one of y'all. I love doing this and I want to continue on doing this and just making it even bigger and better. That's my hope. So thank y'all so, so much for spending your time with me. And until next time, y'all take care of yourselves and take care of each other. And I will see you soon.